Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. In this video I'm going to be showing you how you can create direct download links from your Google Drive files and folders. Now there's three methods of doing this and I'm going to be showing you all three of them. But first, what is a direct download link? A direct download link means that when a person clicks on that URL, it takes them directly to a download for that file. It does not take them to a preview window or any kind of user interface or anything like that, like Google normally does. So let me give you an example. If I right click on this picture and I get shareable link, it's going to automatically copy a shareable link for me. And if I paste that into a new tab, you can see that it directs me to an image preview. Now this is not a direct download link because if I wanted to download it, I actually need to go right up to the right hand side of the screen and click download. This is my downloaded file right here. So a direct download link would actually bypass that extra step that's not needed to get to your file. So how do you create a direct download link from your Google Drive files? Well, the first method I'm going to be showing you is how to do it manually and it's very easy. Right click, go to get shareable link and make sure that the green little switch is turned on and it will automatically copy your URL for you. And let's go into a text document. So let's look at this URL. Here's a URL that Google gives you. We are going to modify this to tell Google I want it to download directly. So we're going to change this open to UC, which means user control. And then at the very end, we're going to tell it what control that we want it to have. So we're going to put and sign export equals download. And now what we can do is we can copy this entire URL go up to a new tab, paste it in, and as you can see, we have a direct download link for our file. So we can go to open and there it is. Now Google recently changed how they set things up with the shareable links. So that is for the get shareable link method. If you right click on your file and you go to share, and then you copy link right here, you will notice that the link is totally different than the link that we had previously. So how you change this, you will also notice if you look at this, this right here is exactly the same as that. That is actually your file ID. So all you have to do to change this link into that, select the files slash D slash and change that to UC question mark, which is the same thing we have up there. So it's user control. The ID, which we're typing that in, equals so user control question mark ID equals, there's your file. And then you want to select the slash view question mark sharing. Delete all that. And then we're going to tell Google what to do again. So and sign export equals download. And there we have it. So I can copy that link, come right back up here, go to a new page. And there we have a direct download link for our file again. So those are the methods of doing that manually. The next method I want to show you is how you can create the exact same thing with an online generator. So Google Drive direct link generator. You basically just paste your URL in here and it gives you an output. Now something that is not very good about doing this. Well, first off, and you can see right here, I just went, I copied the link. I'm going to paste it in. So it's right there. Same thing we had before it's going to tell me that it's an error because I did not go exactly the way they said right here, even though we just proved that we could create one with that. So if I come in here and go to share, then I get my link, then I go back. Now it gives me a direct download link for it. So it's not as reliable as doing it yourself, but it does save you a little bit of time. Another downside of doing this online is ultimately this is insecure because anybody who has access to the website will have access to your files because you are giving them the URL to access those files so they can do anything they want with those files. So that's not a secure way of doing it. Not only that, online generators are typically not reliable. But I'm going to show you another method of creating direct download links. 
and that is with a program known as G Drive Linker. And G Drive Linker, which I have brought up right here, is also the only method of creating direct download links for files as well, but we'll get to that in a minute. So I'm going to right click here, I'm going to get shareable link, and I'm going to go right up here and I'm going to paste it in a G Drive Linker. And as you can see, it has the download link ready for me. Copy that, paste, and there we have the file. And to prove that it works on both ways, I'm going to go to share. I want to copy that link, go right back down here. Let's clear everything out, paste in the link, and it says it's valid too. So let's copy that and paste it in. The beautiful thing about G Drive Linker, it is completely offline. So everything is 100% secure with it. It does not connect online at all unless you tell it to. Another great thing about G Drive Linker, and this is the only application that does this, if you want to share an entire folder, you can. For instance, if I copy this entire folder right here, and I go into the online link generator, paste it in there, it's going to say that it's invalid URL. There is no other application available other than G Drive Linker that can share an entire folder. For instance, I'm going to clear this, and I'm going to paste a shareable link of the folder and it says right here please add to list to generate links this is a folder so add to list and as you can see we now have all the files that were inside of that folder so I'm just going to go in here I'm going to see copy that and let's paste it up here and that file is Okay, that one. So let's go and let's see if that's in there. And there it is. Now another great thing about G Drive Linker, it exports into Excel. It can do files, it can do folders, it even has a list right here saying where the item is located at. So another great thing about G Drive Linker is if you just need it for four or five times, then Go ahead and download the trial. The trial is completely free and it's also 100% unlocked for the first five times. So you have full functionality of all features. You can convert however many files you need. You are allowed five times completely for free. And then once you run out of those five uses, even then the program is not very expensive. It's very cheap. So G Drive Linker is really the way to go. And there you have it. That is the three methods of creating direct download links using Google Drive. So thank you all very much for watching. I hope that you've enjoyed this video. If you did, like, subscribe, comment down below. Let me know if there's anything else that you'd like me to show or explain how to do on here. If you have any suggestions, let me know. Comment down below. Please like and subscribe. It really does help us out a lot. Thank you all very much for watching. I hope that this has helped.